staying in Nigeria, the government has inaugurated a governing board that will regulate senior school education. Speaking during the inauguration ceremony in the nation's capital, Abuja, the Minister of Education, Adamu Adamu, urged members of the board to work towards improving the quality of senior secondary school education. He also called for synergy among relevant agencies in the education sector to help deliver quality education to millions of young Nigerians, but putting into mind the principles of fairness and federal character. We must ensure prudent and efficient management of the limited resources the government will give you. You should respect the principle of clear character in the appointment of your staff. You must comply, you must comply with all relevant government regulations and extend policies in addition to ensuring transparency probity and due process in all their endeavors. You should put effective strategies in place for early detection and eradication of social biases such as drug dealing, religious interests, and other forms of misconduct. All opportunities should be harnessed by members of the board to put the commission on the sound footing by facilitating supervision and guide them in accordance with the application for change ministerial strategic plan 2018 to 2022, which is intended to provide the roadmap for an accelerated delivery of inclusive quality education to all Nigerian citizens. Since my previous review that members of this commission are run pairs in run coach who are all the chase to formulate policies for and supervise senior secondary education in the country. The fact before us is a very daunting one, but not insurmountable. I am very confident of this because of my personal belief in our indefatigable Minister of Education, Malam Adamu Adamu. 